Hi there, this is Roisin O'Connor here again with you and today I want to talk to you about time. Time is our most precious and valuable asset in life in general but also in, or in particular when we're building a home-based business and also in network marketing because in network marketing well how long does it take for you to succeed? How much time does it take? And a very valuable question you can keep in mind when you ask, when you wonder how long it's going to take is, well, how long does it take to build a relationship? Keep that question in mind. How long does it take to build a relationship? It takes time. It takes time to develop a relationship, to create trust, to create a bond, rapport. So therefore you have to give yourself time. You have to make time work for you, not against you. You have to basically be in control of your own time. Be the captain of your time, not the captive. So, not captive of your time. So basically, um, one of the most fantastic books I've ever read regarding this issue is it's called The Slight Edge by Jeff Olson. And in The Slight Edge, Jeff Olson talks about, um, he uses Earl Nightingale's famous quote about success is the progressive realization of a worthy ideal. So basically, what does that mean? It means you take the consistent daily action in order for you to be able to develop your business, to develop yourself over time. So to make time work for you and not against you. So basically, you'll hear me talk about time very often because it's one of my favorite topics. Hmm. Yeah, it's one of my most, um, basically, it challenges me the most time and thankfully I've learned how to improve my management of time by plan, do, review, adjust, by basically changing how I do things, exploring and by talking to different people and some person, a person I'm really indebted to is a good friend and mentor Maria Whitehead in New Zealand and basically I was talking to Maria one day and I was telling her about my challenges with time and she shared her daily worksheet with me, her daily and weekly worksheet of the particular tasks that she needs to do in order to move forward to progress within her business and so I took them and I worked on, I, I worked on it basically dividing my tasks per amount of time I have each day because obviously I have a another job as well I, I teach English I teach English in businesses if anybody doesn't know that about me and so therefore I have to manage my time very well in order to spend time with the people I want to be with um, and do all the things I want to do so if I have a daily and weekly worksheet of the tasks I I want to do in order to progress in my business and progress myself as a person, so self-development, I need to have these down on a sheet for me to work with. If not, I lose focus. So, um, the, the, another wonderful thing about that is, as I'm working, I tick off what I'm doing. So therefore, once it's done, it's done. I can enjoy the rest of my time. It's done. It's out of, it's out of my mind. I don't have to think about it anymore. And plus, it creates a huge sense of satisfaction because I can see everything I've done that particular day. Because sometimes in the muddle of things that we do, we forget exactly what we did at 8 o'clock in the morning. Whereas if it's written down, if it's ticked off, you have such satisfaction of having it done. At least that's the way I feel about it. Everybody's different. But, you know, there are different ways for different people. And you learn to, you can learn to find the best way that suits you. I'm just saying that's what works for me now. So I'm very grateful for, to Maria for sharing that with me. Um, so we'll come back to talk about time again soon. So stay tuned. And I appreciate all your comments. And you know, if you want to share this with your, with your team, that would be really great. Because obviously, um, the more we share, the more we ourselves grow because when we see another person's material we get something from it whatever it may be so I hope today you've enjoyed what I've had to share with you and
and you can take something from it. If you've, if I've left you with some questions, you know, some questions in your mind, please contact me. Um, you, you can contact me by downloading the free ebook, which is underneath. It's um, it's the first way to get started on working on building your home-based business. So if you want to contact me, please feel free to do it. And thank you for your comments, because with your comments, I can improve myself and therefore add more value to these videos. And that's exactly what I what my mission is. Okay, so have a great week and nice talking to you again. Bye bye.